I'm looking for a uh, new health plan. Uh, my friend has suggested I come here to uh, medical care, and um, what I'm doing is looking over the uh, home page here and uh, determining whether or not this is a site that I want to uh, to sign up for a, for a medical care plan. Uh, what I'm seeing here is uh, um, medical care, uh, you need professional services about us, mission values. Now the thing that, that, uh, the, that I first notice about this page is that there is no left margin. Uh, basically all the information is shifted clear over to the left side of the page which uh, does not appear very professional or certainly not very, uh, it, it does not seem optimized for Internet Explorer which is by the way what I'm using. Uh, I have this wide right margin over here with all the information crammed over here to the left. Uh, it, it just looks out of balance. Um, I see standard navigation about us, mission values, uh, uh, health plans, medical education, latest news, welcome to the website. Now what I like about the, uh, the site is that it's simply laid out. Uh, it's very simple. It's, it's, it's easy to see what's going to be on this page. <clears throat> um, in other words, there's not too much information crammed in. I see a basic uh, uh, like dashboard up here where I would uh, sign in with my username and password. What I'd like to see though uh, would be um, uh, medical care and then some sort of tagline. What exactly is this site going to offer me? <clears throat> because I feel what I'm doing is I'm looking, it's just medical care. Okay, medical care, well that's a pretty broad uh, subject. Um, <laughs> and and I, I must also point out something here as well. This photograph, uh, it looks kind of creepy, honestly. Uh, this guy looks like he's, I don't know, I don't know what he's doing. He's, he's really checking her out and she's looking over her shoulder. It, this, is a, this is an odd picture. It almost looks like a, like a funny picture. Uh, I, I, I could come up with a funny caption of myself, but uh, it, it strikes me as being a very odd picture. Uh, you need professional services, click here. Uh, so uh, as far as the uh, things that I like about this page, uh, I like the simplicity of the layout. Uh, I think it's easy to see what I'm going to do here, latest news and events, welcome to the website. I have the links up here at the top, what we offer, uh, new services, and then uh, a toll-free number down here at the bottom left of the page. Uh, what I don't like about the page is the, uh, is the layout, uh, or uh, is, is the placement uh, on, the, uh, on the page itself. I don't like it being shifted all over uh, to the left, where I have this huge white, uh, right margin over here. So, um, what I want to do is, uh, is go ahead and apply for the health care plan. And uh, how would I do that? Let's go ahead and click on health plans here. Ah, here we go. Calculate the right plan for you. Okay, we'll go ahead and put in uh, our name. And uh, I'm going to put in some double dummy information. There we go. And uh, let's put in 0606. Oh, oh you have to have the calendar. Uh, let's just say, oh, okay, as you can see, I'm having a little bit of trouble, uh, and we'll put in a different year. Well, <laughs> well, that's silly. Why can't I, uh, that's, that's, that's very annoying. So you, you're telling me I have to scroll all the way back to my birth date in order to put it in. I can't just, uh, enter it. Yeah, that's very, very annoying. Okay, let's uh, let's stop here and say there. Uh, yeah, that 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 was very annoying. Uh, male nationality. Uh, there we go. Country of residence. Um, and. Uh, Okay, so what I've done is I've put in my information here. <coughs> Pardon me. Uh, again, biggest problem I had was the date of birth field, uh, where I could not input dates, where I had to actually use the calendar. It was the only way that I could get information in. Obviously, that's going to be extremely difficult if uh, if I'm 80 years old because you keep hitting that back button for uh, 80 times uh, to get me back to the proper date. Uh, so that 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 was not very intuitive, not very uh, easy to use. And what I'm doing right now is I'm going to select a plan uh, and a worldwide evacuation for a range of health screenings, vaccinations, and dental optia. Looks like uh, some information here is cut off. 
I'm clicking on the question button, nothing is happening. So obviously the, uh, the information on this particular section uh, is not complete. Uh, looks like the, uh, like the sentences are cut off. What I do like about this uh, section is that you're telling me exactly where I am in the process. In other words, my personal details, I, I uh, was on the fr uh, previous page. On this page, I'm choosing my plan, then I'm going to put in my medical history, then I'm going to be uh, processing my payments. So let's go ahead and select this one, and we'll continue. I also like the uh, uh, option to go to the back button or, or go to the previous page. Okay, so uh, annual total medical history. Uh, we'll say no, no, no to everything. And I'm looking over here. And then I could also uh, go back to choose plan uh, if I wanted to edit that or back to uh, my personal details from that plan page as well. So I like that. Okay. Uh, and actually, let's see. Do I lose information if I go back here? Just click that and continue. Yeah, apparently I, I do lose information. Okay. Let's uh, click that. And we'll click on continue. And this is where... Uh, and I'm kind of curious here, if I can go back, okay, then I would have to put that in again if I wanted to go back here, and if I wanted to go back here, oh, wow. So you're, so what happened, uh, if you saw that, is that I, uh, all of my information was uh, erased uh, if I go back. So now what I get to do is do this all over again, uh, click it back. 35 times or whatever it might be uh, to get back to my birth date. And uh, let's just say that uh, that's our birth date. Okay. And uh, we'll say gender, we'll say male. We've got to do it all over again. And then I have to find United States again here. Uh, And as you can see, it's not real easy to use the uh, the drop-down field. So the reason that I did this was I came back here uh, just under the under the, uh, the possibility that I may have uh, um, reconsidered my country of residence, let's say. So I wanted to come back and change that. Well, unfortunately, what happened was uh, it wiped out all my information. I had to start all over again. So now I'm clicking on this. Um, again, not particularly easy to use, in my opinion. And uh, definitely, the birth date was the worst. So let's go ahead and say that we're having a visa. And there we go, valid from. Use that drop down. Uh, let's say it's 9 12. Uh, oh, can't go to 2012 apparently. Okay. Oh, I see. I'm sorry. A valid from. And then expiration date. I've never had a valid from uh, field. Now, why would you ask for my social security number? Uh, the last three digits in the back. Of... Oh, so, uh, I'm sorry. I looked at that and I thought social security number, not security number. Okay, let's go ahead and confirm payment. And then there wasn't any kind of confirmation. So uh, it just kind of dumped me back to the home page, which was extremely anticlimactic in my opinion. So again, problem that I had, I think the biggest problem uh, on that, uh, on the enrollment form, was the fact that I had to uh, uh, find my birth date using that calendar, that there was no other way to do it. Again, issue that I have is the layout of the page or, or the placement of the information on the page with this huge right margin just doesn't uh, look very professional. Again, I think this is a really uh, creepy picture, and uh, I would have liked to have had some sort of tagline uh, underneath the, uh, the logo there to explain to me what this site was, what I was going to be able to do on this site, and the value proposition that it was presenting. Well, I hope this information is helpful. Appreciate your time, and uh, have a good day.